Hey guys, James with TFB TV. I'm over here at the DSA booth. And it's funny, I, I've always liked DSA. When I was in college, one of my first battle rifles was like an old school DSA STG 58. Yeah, uh, back when, yeah, oh man, they were incredible. So, uh, always been a love of mine. I've always gone out of my way to come over to the DSA booth and talk to you guys just because I'm always interested to see what you have. But it just so happens, and I say this every year, your videos end up being like some of the most popular shot coverage. That's so good. I'm glad that everybody out there is as interested in, in this uh, as I am because, you know, the FAO is somewhat of a boutique product this year, but you guys have really made it an art out of it. Mm -hmm. So what do we have this year? Well, the main thing that we're, that we're really trying to promote at Red the FAO right now is this idea that FALs aren't as accurate as other guns, which is not what people think it is. A lot of times the accuracy uh, problems that a person may have on this gun and says that, and will say that a modern gun may be more accurate, is caused from the stock not aiding the shooter in the accuracy department. So what we have done is refined the stock by allowing many adjustments in length of pole and also in the cheek piece, which will tilt mm -hmm. and go straight. Mm -hmm. What this will do is it allow the shooter to really hold the gun nice and tight and stable and get the accuracy that the FAL actually does possess. Mm -hmm. uh, once you get good sight picture and stable platform, considering that all semi-autos are, the lock time is slower. Right. And what this does, because you can hold it so stable, because this stock can be tailored just like you would have tailored an old shotgun mm -hmm. and would have had some uh, gunsmiths make the shotgun stock exactly for your face, you can do that with this with this stock, which will allow you to really hold it stable and get the accuracy out of it. Not to mention, but also, in, 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 or also to mention, is in snap shooting, you need to have a, a stock that fits you well if you want to make a clean shot in snap shooting or quick shooting or tactical shooting or whatever you want to call it nowadays. Um, it will aid in that. And then further ergonomic improvements as well with the uh, extended charging handle, the enlarged trigger guard, the ambidestrous safe, um, mag release. All those will give you that extra bit of refinement that people want to, they want to see in this gun because they love the gun so much as you were talking about. But honestly, it's there's stuck some modern, in like the 20th century. A little it's, bit, yeah. yeah, yeah and that's really what we're trying to do here. We have a new M lock handguard. And that reduces weight and allows you to install the handguard without removing your old ring, which our old Picatinny one, like this handguard, you had to remove the handguard ring and it wasn't as backwards compatible. Now, the stock, are you offering it a la carte? Yes, it's $250 for the stock itself. It does require a para operation, which is will cost a little bit, but it's actually a, a, a something a consumer should consider because that para bolt carrier is sand cut. Mm -hmm. It also allows for a straight pullback in the recoil mm -hmm. where the original FAL would, the, re the recoil screen was in the stock and it would kind of give you a little bit more muzzle rise. Mm -hmm. This is that, if you go with a para operation on FAL, it reduces the muzzle rise tension. Do you offer it with a para kit as yes, well? Yes, we do. And, and, and what's that run? With the para kit, you're going to be looking around $500. Okay. And now the handguard, uh -huh. MSRP and release date. MSRP is uh, $169.99 and the release date is, I think, six weeks. Now, this platform, is this available as, I can buy this as a complete gun? I mean, of course, minus the suppressor, right? Yes, our, our SPR, our, our long range uh, tactical um, counter sniper mm -hmm. system, that comes with all the goodies on, including the stock and even a scope. And then all the way down to like this OSW here, which is an 11 inch SBR. Mm -hmm. um, actually it looks great. Available with a brace too. So uh, if you don't want to get an right, SBR, you can right. do that too. Uh, but then you wouldn't be able to get the stock. But you sure. can get the, uh, the extended charging handle and mag release and uh, trigger guard and stuff like that. What does this run complete? Of course, minus the accessories that are on. Yeah, it. minus the suppressor. The suppressor, the light, and the, the light, the optic, the EOTech yeah. and stuff. It's it's going to be around two thousand dollars. Okay, all but right. That's all. That's completely outfitted. And if you look at the market and and uh, the features of other guns in the market, it's really comparable. But you have a sixty year track history that sure. you don't have with the other guns, sure. and you have a uh, incredibly soft shooting rifle. And now with this stock. You have a rifle you will really be able to enhance your accuracy the shooter's accuracy and the speed on target because you have just tailored that stock to your particular body well the foul's still doing it after all these years and you guys just seem to make it sexier and sexier every shot show so it looks great i love the modernization thank you so much for talking with Always. me as Thank usual you. um and have a great show you too